stay is Misty's boyfriend of seven years, Sean. You see, Sean has proposed to Misty three different times. Misty's response has always been the same, no. Because Misty fears Sean is leading a secret double sex life and will not marry him until he passes this lie detector test. Now, not only does Misty fear that Sean is sneaking out in the middle of the night to have sex with a neighbor, she was horrified to find another woman's underwear in her bed. Wow. I've been with this man for seven years, but the only thing that matters to me right now is that lie detector test. Everything started when I heard he was talking on the phone all day to other women. I'm afraid he's been having sex with his ex and the neighbor. I have women calling me, telling me that Sean's taking him out to dinner, and then I found a pair of lace panties. He had the nerve to blame it on the laundry mat. He started coming home with glitter on his face when I thought he was working. But when I called his job, they said they had no record of him even working there. Sean has proposed to me three times, but each time I told him no. In fact, I told him to take the ring back. If I find out he's failed this lie detector test, he can go work on a relationship with another woman. He proposed to you three times. And every time I said no. Why? I can't marry someone that I don't trust. So when did you first suspect that he was cheating? It's been since the very beginning, Maury. Really? He couldn't let his ex go, and she, he didn't, ex. she didn't want to let him go. She told me they went out to dinner, went to hotels, oh. that they were sleeping together. What did he say? That she was just trying to break us up. He goes to work, and you think he's cheating. And he comes home with glitter, scratches. Oh, oh wait, 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 wait a minute. Where did he say he got it? He said the glitter was mine, the scratches were a box fell on him. Where did he go in the middle of the night? To the neighbor's house in the middle of the night. What'd you find in the bedroom? Panties that were way too small for me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, those were, yeah. This is what Sean had to say. I love Misty so much, I've asked her to marry me over three times in the last seven years. Every time, it's the same answer. No, no, no. It's really taking its toll on me emotionally. Misty's always crying and accusing me of cheating. But she doesn't realize what this is doing to me. Misty thinks I had sex with our neighbor. But the only reason that I was over there was school fundraiser. I would never, ever disrespect Misty by having sex with another woman. But there's nothing I can say to make Misty believe me. I'm counting on these results today to save the love that I have for this woman. Here's Sean, everybody. This woman. Yes. You've asked her to marry you three times. Probably more than that. And and she won't. No. Why doesn't she have confidence in you? It's my fault. When we first got together, I cheated on her with the ex that with the ex. You were kind of going back and forth with the ex. How about you and the neighbor? Never happened. How about the panties uh, in the uh, bed? I don't know anything about any panties. <laughs> Glitter on your face. I was a roofer. It came from cutting tin. Right. <laughs> You wanted to take this lie detector test, didn't I you? called the show. You were asked if during your relationship with Misty, when she left for 30 days, did you use that time to have sexual intercourse with another woman? You said no. The lie detector test determined you're telling the truth. You were asked if during your relationship with Misty, have you ever had sexual intercourse with another woman? in the home you share with Misty. You said no, the lie detector test determined you're telling the truth. <laughs> when you claimed you had a job and Misty found out you didn't, were you really using the time to have sexual intercourse with another woman? You said no, the lie detector test determined you're telling the truth. <laughs> During your relationship with Misty, have you ever had sexual contact of any kind with the neighbor? You said no. The lie detector test determined you're telling the truth. You were asked, during your relationship with Misty, have you ever had sexual intercourse with another woman? You admitted to our lie detector administrator you have, and the test also determined one woman, one time. That was it.
Dave Cohen here. So, one more time.